Greece has mounted its biggest evacuation ever at Rhodes as wildfires fanned by high-speed winds raged for a sixth day. The country's fire department said 19,000 people, mostly tourists and hotels, had been moved as blazes continued to spread uncontrollably on the three fronts across the Aegean island. About 16,000 were transferred by land, the rest by sea. Greece's economy is highly dependent on tourism, and authorities acted quickly to ensure that holidaymakers were moved out of harm's way as the infernos ripped through pine forests on the island popular for its beaches and ancient ruins. On what was being called the hottest July weekend in 50 years in Greece, temperatures were predicted to reach 45 degrees Celsius. The hot, dry, windy conditions are perfect fuel for fires nationwide. Scores of blazes have broken out across Greece since the start of the heatwave with new infernos on Evia, the country's second biggest island. The battle to continue the fires has quickly become an international effort as fire-fighting forces from the Czech Republic, France and Turkey rushed to roads. Paris and Ankara sent water dumping planes to support 49 fire trucks and 266 firefighters and the help from other countries also coming in. But this is to note that Greece is going through a very tough time for now which no one has ever imagined in decades.